Greetings, everyone, and I hope this finds you well. Hi, my name is Kathleen Zemanski. I'm a business feng shui master, business astrologer, and the creator of the Time Blazer Business Management System. The reason I'm talking to you today is it's really time to start thinking about the year ahead. And what I'm specifically talking about is the metal ox. So we can pretty much all agree that this past year of the metal rat was probably one of the most tumultuous years years that will go down in history. And we're going to be talking about this time period for probably centuries. <laughs> so really what I want to encourage you to do is really start realizing that one, we're never really going back to how things were. We are actually just going to move forward. We are going to pivot. We're going to adjust and we're all going to get through this. This is how I feel I can really help you. One, I have an annual event that happens every year. It's This year, it's going to be January 16th and 17th, 2021. And I also have a companion book that I think that would really be uh, comprehensive information for you to understand. And the name of the book is Success Secrets for 2021 Metal Ox. And here's what both of these are going to be covering. It's going to be covering person, space, time, and universe. And I believe those four aspects are a way for you to help navigate through these challenging times. So the first piece about the person, it's about business astrology. So really understanding what your hidden talents are, what um, specific things that you need to be doing, and even understanding what your blind spots are, that's one of the ways that you can dodge some of this negative energy. Number two, is we're all working remotely. Let's face it, this has been something just unprecedented that the whole world at various times uh, of, of this tumultuous time would make us be sheltering in place and locked down whatever it's called in your particular area. And sorry to say that that light switch is really not going to flip from one year to the next. We really have to have this continuation of this very unsettling time. And it's going to probably last throughout 2021. And I do believe that these tools will help you. And specifically feng shui, if you really understand the meaning behind what it is really there to help you with, it's achieving your goals. So if you've had fallen off or you had to pivot, you've had to start over, well, this is really a good way to help support and ground and anchor what you're trying to do. You're, wherever you're living, even if you've lost it all, and I am truly sorry for those of you who have, because there's been great, great loss this past year. So really, wherever you're at, to try to help your space support you is going to be very, very, very important. So understanding where the flow is at and also understanding where the challenging energy is so that you can avoid that negative vibration. That is going to be one of your first great steps. So you're going to want to get your floor plan ready for that as well. And then number three is understanding favorable timing, which I'll be talking about at my event and I talk about in my success secret book, is for you to understand that when you take the right action at the right time, things will flow a lot easier for you. And then this year, we're also going to be talking about the universal gateway, which is tapping into your universal intelligence. Universal gateway in Chinese is called qi men dun jia, but really what it is, it's really tapping into the universe to help you get out of the way so that you can actually achieve more at a higher vibration with actually more ease. So here's a couple of things that I would encourage you to do. First, go ahead and start preparing all the things that you're going to need so that because my my two days with you is actually going to be very action based. We're going to really get things going for you. So you're going to want to download your astrology chart at free businessastrology.com. Number two, you're going to want to get an accurate floor plan. So 
if you own the space, maybe it's in your closing docs, you could you know, refer to your building department. I'm not sure in, in various areas of the world on how those records are kept. You could also go um, and, and get an app of some sort to really uh, design it out or even go old school and grab a tape measure and go ahead and measure out the space that you have and try to make it as accurate as possible because then we're gonna overlay three incredible dials over your space to help you. One is gonna be the annual feng shui, one is going to be the annual flying star, and the third is going to be the universal gateway dial, which is really tapping into that universal intelligence, if you will, so that you can really increase the vibration of your space alone. And then we're also going to be doing something that is very unique to my uh, annual event that I've been doing for years is we're going to set your goals. We're going to do a goal setting, uh, incredible uh, exercise during the, the, the time that's based on your astrology so that you're actually in the flow because you by by coming to this event or reading the book you're going to find that you're you have certain energetics that are there just ready to support you and then there's going to be others that are going to be a little bit challenging so we really need to find where this balance is at and it's going to be like a a, a nice jigsaw puzzle that we're going to put all the pieces together together for you Okay. All right. So I'm really excited about seeing you on the, uh, the event, which is January 16th and 17th. It's going to be live stream. So everyone will be safe and sound and you can watch from the comfort of your home. And, you know, here's an FAQ that I hear all the time that, you know, we live in different time zones from California where I, I am living that um, I may not be able to make it because it's in the middle of the night. Not to worry, we'll provide a replay for you as well. So this is pretty interesting information that you're going to want to probably listen to more than once anyway. So anyway, for now, I would like for you to be safe and be well, and I look forward to seeing you on January 16th and 17th. Take care. Many blessings.